Hey, Air Signs, it's Nicola. So let's see what messages we have. This is for Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. What messages do we have for Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Guys, I'll be back together tomorrow. Y'all know my location has been shifty lately, but I have had a lot of things going on. My mom is currently in recovery, so I'm at her house helping her to recover. So let's see what messages we have. She's fine, guys. She's fine. <laughs> she's in some pain, but she's fine. What messages do we have for Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is for March the 13th, 2019. What messages do we have for Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. March the 13th, 2019. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. All right, so let's see what we got. Hmm. Earth signs, underlying energy, ace of cups. That is a good thing. That is a great thing. It's a motherfucking awesome thing. All right, Knight of Wands here. Could come in an offer of uh, something else. Could be fast movement here. Mm -mm. I don't see no fast movement because I see someone guarded here. There's emotional fulfillment here, but someone has anxiety about <laughs> what? Wait a minute now. Wait a mother fucking minute. So we got all this underlying good stuff here, right? All this underlying good stuff here. Ten of Cups, Ace of Cups. Uh, yeah, Knight of Wands under there. But 3-3, three, 3-3. Three, three, three. Could be a third party. Someone could be guarded against that. Um, could be trying to have patience with the situation here. Let's just see what's going on here. There needs to be movement. But the balance is, is, you need to come together to make the balance. That's what I'm seeing. Someone's guarded against that. Ten of Cups here. Why is this Ten of Cups here? Why is this Ten of Cups here? This Ten of Cups here. Someone's trying to manifest something. So someone, oh, Ten of Wands, Ten of Cups, Ten of Wands. Someone feels like the emotions or a situation may be resisting making an offer. Ooh. So someone's burdening themselves by resisting making an offer. Knight of Swords, maybe messages, maybe dealing with some aggression. There's some burdens here. Someone's trying to resist those um, burdens. So maybe someone may be worried here. Um, hmm. Maybe worried about emotional fulfillment. Seven of Wands resisting. Why are you resisting? Are you resisting balancing your emotions? Are you resisting the offer of emotional fulfillment? King of Wands here. Um the one here but why three of swords here healing so someone's healing they're in a new space and they're healing here okay so they know here wow they know that truth to what so someone knows that truth to i guess emotions would i don't know if it's changed things so this can go one of two ways because there's some truth here that has moved someone into a new space. I don't know if it's truth as in something being spoken or clarity because um, for some of you guys, this is clarity, but this is you going within yourself and seeing something new, something from a new perspective, seeing some sort of maybe relationship, 10 of cups, 10 of pentacles, I mean, 10 of cups, 10 of wands, maybe seeing a relationship. Um, from a new perspective, resisting an offer, really focusing on moving toward wish fulfillment. So someone's focused on moving toward wish fulfillment. Seeing the, someone sees a relationship here as an, as a burden. So they're resisting that, not wanting that, wanting something new. Someone wants something new. Someone doesn't want the, whatever's there. Four pinnacles here, there's a guard. Someone that definitely has a guard up here. Um, really, whew, yeah. So they're not talking. Someone is, they're, they're mm, not talking, not speaking, really wanting to move forward. Someone is really blocking someone here, wanting to move forward. A magician here, wanting to manifest and move forward. Really, really very focused on, someone's focused on getting things done for them. The opportunity, okay, so the underlying energy, you know, excuse my little house shoes, they fuzzy. The opportunity is the Ace of Cups, or the offer is the Ace of Cups, meaning this could be a new home, new love, something that brings emotional fulfillment to you. 
but someone here is guarded against an offer. I don't think just because it's an offer doesn't mean that uh, it's the offer for you. And some of you guys know this because you went within yourself. You're aware of what you want, so you're focused on your wish fulfillment. What I believe what is happening is someone is pushing their wishes onto you, and you are blocking that. Um, you're standing firm with what you want, so you're having patience on what you've manifested to come in. That's, that's, that's pretty damn good. That's pretty damn good. Um, someone could be holding on to you and you could be blocking them. Nine of swords. And I know I keep saying blocking, but that's what it is. Somebody's blocking like, no, I don't want to go there with you. I'm not going to do this with you. Nine of swords. Someone has anxiety. Okay, so the thing about it is, Empress here, Two of Pentacles, someone's imbalanced here. Imbalanced about either going within their highest vibration. Ooh, three pentacles here. They're imbalanced about a partnership coming undone. So you're wanting to cooperate in order to move forward, in order to kind of allow things to flow within the situation, and someone could be blocking that. Someone could want the partnership, could want the relationship together, and that's not what you want. So you're not speaking. Um, high Priest is in reverse moon card. You're not speaking. You're not opening up. You're just mute, quiet. A lot going on behind the scenes. You're trying to manifest some movement forward. Someone in your surrounding energy has anxiety about that, really feeling imbalanced. Um, could be a mother, could be a wife, could be some, it could be, it's a woman. It's a woman having anxiety here. Um, really needing to find the courage to put some things in motion so they can move forward, and that's the truth. But having too much anxiety, not, you could be dealing with someone that, has like a disorder like a, a mental disorder because here there's not and there's no reason for this person to have anxiety empress here two of pentacles ace of pentacles these are very positive cards meaning that they have the ability to get out of this state of suspension and go toward look the cooperation is them getting out of suspension and going toward ace of pentacles something new for themselves but Someone is imbalanced within their emotion, having anxiety between their mental and their emotions, meaning they can't control their emotions. So it becomes a disorder. So you could be dealing with someone that has a mental disorder, um, has anxiety, um, which is, it's still, I, mean, I, I have anxiety, it's a mental disorder. Um, but this is someone that is imbalanced within their foundation. That is the anxiety here. So they're causing worry or causing a pause in action and moving forward. You're trying to have patience with the situation, but you're very much not happening. Some of you guys don't want secrets, so you're not speaking. Um, you're focused on moving forward because there's something secret about a situation here. Moon here, high priestess in reverse, there's something secret, so you're resisting that. Three of Pentacles here. Why is Three of Pentacles here? Why is Three of Pentacles here? So some of you guys want to cooperate to move forward. You're within yourself. You're trying to have patience through your pinnacles, but you're trying to put some things in motion. You feel, you feel as though it's time to put some things in motion in order to balance some situations out. I told you, there's there can be balance here, but there's a separation. There's a separation. I think there's two different viewpoints here within the situation. Why is this three of wands here? You could be having patience with a partnership, the third party. Someone in the third party could be having patience with the situation. Someone could have anxiety, feeling imbalanced, maybe dealing with a woman. Um, sun card here, six of cups here, clarity here about the past, clarity about me. So Taurus here is having patience here. Um, wow. Ten of Pentacles. So there is a stagnation. It's shown here as having patience moving toward a soulmate, moving toward a relationship. Six of Cups, Hierophant, this is a sun card. This is a happy relationship. Um, but that's having patience or waiting for that to come in. Some of you guys could be waiting for a relationship to come in, waiting for a partnership to come in. Ten of Pentacles, Two of Swords, the underlying energy, Ace of Cups. This is anxiety, because the Nine of Swords is under here, okay? So this is anxiety here about moving toward a new offer here. Ace of Cups, Ten of Pentacles, but Two of Swords. So there's a new opportunity here. It's the same thing that's on my, my board. 
Some of you guys got a new opportunity, but you have anxiety about moving toward it. Um, you're blocking something at the same time. It seems like you got a lot going on. So there may be a need for you to really go within yourself and to evaluate, you know, <laughs> what exactly are you working on? Because you got a partnership here. It's like you're working on a partnership, but you're trying to have patience with something else as well. That, that could be kind of challenging. So let's see what guidance we have. Let's see what guidance we have for Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, Sun, Rising, Venus. Right future. Stop worrying. <laughs> Says stop. Yeah. So some of you guys do need to. Yeah. I know what I was talking about. Some of you guys need to purify your surroundings. You may be in some sort of partnership that you need to purify because it's causing a blockage and you moving forward. And I think you know that. That's why you're really trying to block and you're focused on moving forward. With right future, but while you're focusing, you have to actually make adjustments each day to focus, you know, to fine tune your moving forward because any way that someone can slip in and pause you or stall you, they will. And here, underlying energy purification, there's something or someone in your energy that you need to purify. It says it's time for your cleansing, detoxification of your body and mind. With bright future, it says stop worrying. Everything is going to be fine. You are just getting started, so have patience with yourself and the process and do not give up. And with expect a miracle, it says have faith that your prayers have been heard and are being answered. That's all I got, y'all. Peace.